we're going to start this one tonight with the lunges. And as you can see, I got the young lions, young lion hearts here. They're just passing through. Say hi, guys. Hi. All right, and you know this is Naya and this is Soraya, right? So guys, you see how they're growing beautiful. God bless. And this is my family right here. This is my um, generation right there. This is why we got to do good things with the youths. Mine's yours. Got to be a perfect example, role model. Give them good energy. And one of the best energy you could also bring to a child is exercising. That will help them now and for the future. All right, so tonight we're going to do some lunges. All right, guys? Lunges are good for the thigh, good for the leg. It's excellent. Are you ready? Yeah. All right, so we're going to start with the leg lunge first. This leg is going to be the first leg. All right, let's go. Mm -hmm. One. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Soraya here. We want to help Soraya. Soraya been slacking up on the squats. And I asked her to squat today. And her squats, she looked like her, her, her looks was looking. Didn't know where exactly to go. So I found out I gave her a bucket. And like I said, this does a lot. And so my brother gave her the bucket. She improved real fast. So Soraya, I'll put this here. And you have the chest, so don't worry about you falling back. And you already did that already, so you already know what to do. Okay? If it's too if it's too far, I'll fix it, but try. Give me a squat. Excellent. Right. So when I tried her earlier on, she didn't squat for a long time and she lost track with her squat. So to bring her back to give her the right form. I placed that little bucket at the back of her. So we gonna squat, and the squats is a full body thing. And especially when you do your squats the right way, they will work, a full body workout. So you're doing tie, you're doing legs, you're doing arms, you're doing lower back, you're doing cloaks, you're doing everything, all right? So let's go guys. We gonna do 10 squats, a perfect squat. So we want the leg, toes pointing straight. We want the knee going not over the toe, but directly pointing the knee is pointing at the toe. All right, let's go. One, two. One of the reasons we put ourselves, our stomach forward and squeeze our toes, it helps with the squats better. So that's where you get to do more than one. So, let's go. One. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Excellent. So the squats are excellent. If you, you what 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 you have learned recently, you have anything, maybe one thing you probably want to show. Probably want to show you that skill that you could do. What is this? Okay. okay. I have like. Other oh, your next workout. Yeah. Okay. They had made a workout today, which is uh, your cake. Opposite leg. Opposite, opposite yeah. Opposite leg, opposite arm. They will do that. Go ahead and do it. One. Control. Two. Three. Control. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Excellent. So 
As you can see in the S and the light, you know, like, you guys came and gave you three different workouts. And you guys could do these workouts and prevent these workouts in your everyday, even the uh, like the opposite leg. That would be excellent for you. <coughs> so, me today, I don't know if this girl, I think that's all of this girl's got for you. Oh, go ahead. Appreciate you all, man. That's the bye. It's a bye. Oh, yeah. Bye, so, guys. So, I got some real seamless right here, the white one. And I got the vest on. Okay. And my vest could go up to 140. I could just keep adding on to it. Go to 140. <laughs> right now, I think it's like uh, 60 or 80 right here. And I have what? One, two, three, four. Four and four. <coughs> One, two, three. I got six in there. Six in there. And I got, I think, four more. Six more pieces of that. I got extra for it. I got a little gel here. Yeah. A little similar gel. You don't need much. So I took some of it on the way. But everything I do. Everything I do is uh, on, a, on a wise level. See that jelly substance? Nobody wants that. Maybe you can take the CMOS. Maybe you can take the CMOS straight like that. Because it's jelly. It has. You can add some honey with it. I take it straight. Sometimes I put honey. But now, sometimes I take it with the honey and sometimes I take it straight like that. But some people cannot take it straight like that. They say it tastes wet. It do sometimes. But you know, everything that's good for you is natural, that raw natural. So today I got the vest on, and I'm gonna look to bust a workout with my vest. And uh, one of the workouts, and I also have the big boy here too. Uh, I also have the big boy here too. So I'm, I'm working quite heavy tonight. Uh, uh, I'm working quite heavy tonight. One, two. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven.
remember this is 45. I told you I was gonna do some weight today. Mm. I was gonna do some weight today. Woo! I'm doing hard on this one. Hey guys, yes, two days though. 20 what? 20. Eighth? Yeah. Today is the 58th day. 58th day, guys. The 58th day of red. Full 90 day full body workout. 58 day. Yesterday I went over the gym, guys. Crunch. I went crazy. You also have videos. You also that stuff. That full bar, two pull ups. Jump up and catch the other one. That was great. I did a lot, so I'm sore, but I like it. So I decided to put the 60 pound on me with the 45 and work with that. Have a little bit of time right here. Ooh. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I don't know, bro. I know 45 is 45. 45 pounds is 45 pounds. 45 pounds of feather. So it'll be 45 pounds. But this 45 pounds feel really like, I don't know, it's more than what it is. I know 45 is 45. But that baby right here, I don't know if it's because it's the Olympic. It's, it's a different type of iron, know still. But that's heavy. Anyway. We work with 45 plate. And I want to do something else with this. What could I do with this? What could I do with this?
crazy, bro. This is the hood for you. Phone came off crooked. Yeah. This is the hood for you. This is what happened in the hood. You be in your crib, I sound like your side. Mm -hmm. That's how I be. That 45 pound doing it dirty. Woo! Anyway, guys. Woo! 20 minutes. 40? 20. Uh, so, um. <laughs> Let's see what you got here. Uh, you guys, don't forget. This is the 40, the 50, uh. Knife. This is what, the 29th? 28th? The 29th. 29th. So, this is the 59th. <laughs> and they. Full body work, I'm red. Alright. One. Two. Yeah. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And we add more weight on top of weight, guys. More weight on top of weight. More weight on top of weight. More weight. I'm so from yesterday, because yesterday I did this workout where it went from, uh, it was starting from 20 pull ups, okay? With the 20 pull, pull ups, hand down, coming down to, going down to one, and it was 30 push ups coming down, so with a lot of other workouts, so all my arms tight and um, I'm sore. But I wanted to put the vest on to do something with the vest, add a little bit extra weight to my weight already. And work with that. And work with that. So that's what I did. One. Two. I'm so I ain't gonna lie. That work out yesterday, I've been so. That work out yesterday is serious. I'm so feeling pain from that work out from yesterday. So, I did say this month was gonna be more hectic and um, 
working with the vest. I'm going and I'm doing multiple marriage. Okay. So here we go. We got the vest. Put some weight more on push-ups. More weight on it. Heavier. The better. One. Let's go. You should sweat. How we can do the kitchen, baby. Let's go. Diamonds with this. I love my vest, bro. Hey guys, don't forget to smash the like button. Share the video, smash the like button. Real intense right here. Got the weight vest on. All men putting in work. We're doing 20s, um, push ups, 20 squats. Just throwing everything, different things. All right? Well, this is a good one. With the extra weight, with the extra weight, Pulling on them arms, you know, making it work. We gonna do, we gonna do this um this size right here, this size here. Good. Then we gonna go a little larger after that. Twenty. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, ten. Sixty. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go, guys. Squats are good. Um, people say, a lot of people say, leg day. Leg day to me is every day. Running, jumping, squats, every day. Okay? And I ain't gonna listen to nobody. A man like me with a lot of injury, I'm not gonna pick up no big. My pajama and put it in my back. But I'm gonna keep my weight and add a little bit of extra with that and work with what I got. None of them wasn't pushed off a building. So they keep talking. The old man was pushed off a building. And uh, by the mercy of God, I'm here, fit as fever. And I'm not gonna put no big person on my back, but I'm gonna do this. Do these. Right. 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, You want another 20? Go for 80. I brought back 100. But a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Wisdom is given to the wise. And wisdom is also given to the foolish. But the foolish cannot blame the wise because the wise won't know what to do with the wisdom. The foolish one thought he knew. Or she thought she knew. So she goes and bragged. But at the end of the day, she never had no oil to lie the lamp. She was just running her mouth. She didn't do what she was supposed to do. She didn't go and get that oil for that lamp. So in the time when she gonna need the light to see through the darkness, she gonna have the oil for her lamp. She didn't do that. What she did, she sat there and she ran her mouth. She sat there and she complained. She sat there and thought make what could have happened, make it impossible. You know, hard times come. And this is an example. For all men on earth, all leaders of nations, all kings and queens, all people of power, to know, to know that the stone that the builder refuses is always be the head corner stone. Let's go guys, next one. <sighs> on the lodge. On the lodge. <sighs> on the lodge. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten. Yeah. So again, be thankful for what you got. Be grateful for what you got. Sometimes you might be in a situation. But that situation is an obstacle and it's a test. For you to pass the test, you got to overcome your fear. You have to overcome your haste. You got to stop being irrational. You know? Stop overthinking. Sometimes what you believe, oh, and that's why I don't deal with belief, because your belief could be your disbelief. And more goals and the connection, total recall, total connection, having that feeling, that gut feeling is different from you trying to think. Majority of the time, you're not that individual. You have not taken time to study that individual. So, majority of the time, your wild guess about this individual as well. Okay? When you judge, you gotta judge wisely. I was watching this judge, and um, it was about a dog. And the woman had the man dog, okay? And she, how much time is this? 32. Oh, that's what I'm gonna give you a lot. Yeah. I'm pretty sure, man. 32. Mm -hmm. <sighs> I appreciate your hard work and dedication. Uh, hard work and dedication. Well, uh, some people tell me, Red, we love your videos, but uh, the only thing, Red, is you should make them a little shorter. So I say, okay. It's the reason why they tell me. Because the videos are good, but sometimes people get bored quick. So even though the video is good, like the one that I tell you where I watch your videos, sometimes it takes me two days, three days, to break it on and watch it. The one person that I read just made them a little shorter. So I'm gonna put that. But I have so much to give, so much to offer. And I, I put so much out there for my people. But like I said, 
Knowledge was given. Knowledge was given. Hey, listen. Knowledge was given. And you know, this was even with the same problem I'm having, this is the vision that I got. This, this, this is the vision that I got. With this, this is the vision God showed me with this issue with the noise that I be having. Most I got, uh, it was day before yesterday. I was slipping. And this is the vision that I got. It was a lot of noise above me. And in my slip, I wake up angry. And I heard the voice say, be cool, be calm. Be ease. He said, nothing that goes on don't go on without a punishment. He said, in the voice, I hear the voice says this, do not trouble your soul when evildoers are persecuting you. In other words, me getting upset when I'm hearing the noise above me and I'm making all that noise that's what they want me to do. So the voice is saying this. It's saying, be still. Don't say anything. Do not complain. Let the noise go on. My Lord will deal with it. He says this. You negative input. It is a form of a curse. And it's a form of a harassment. And this is what the enemy does. To make you forsake yourself. So he said be still. Do not get upset. Do not exercise your energy. Do not wake up in the morning or any time. Whilst the enemy is provoking you. To allow the enemy to get you. And cause you to get off your righteousness. He said be still. And allow them to do what they do. And I shall handle them accordingly to what they dished out. So from that, I don't say nothing no more. I don't make noise no more. I don't even complain no more. Uh, I ain't even calling the police no more. I'm just going to be still like my Lord says. I'm not going to argue. I'm not going to let nobody know they're making noise because they know they do. So my Lord said to me, be still. Be still means don't make no noise. Don't get up and let them get under my skin. Don't let them get under my skin and my insanity. My Lord said, be still. And I shall deal with them. That's how I get it in my, in, while I was sleeping. That's how I got it. So when I got it like that, I have not complained. After that video I'm making, I'm letting you all guys know. That my Lord has shown me. What's going to take place? So he said, but if I keep getting up and making noise, if I keep arguing, if I keep, it takes two. He said, pull yourself away. Be still. Do not give them your energy. Do not allow them to see you getting frustrated. Because that's how they're getting their strength when they frustrate you. When they see that you feeling uncomfortable or you making them believe that they make you uncomfortable... They're going to keep. So my Lord said, be still. Be still and keep a still tongue in thy mouth. Don't say nothing. Don't make noise. Don't complain to no one. Don't do nothing. Just allow them to do what they do. And my Lord will deal with them. And that's what I'm doing, guys. Once again, all praise is unto the highest king. Time is short and the enemy is at hand. I say, stay in prayer. I wake up yesterday. Morning, three o'clock in the morning, I, I kneel and pray, and I, 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 he allows God allow me to see things in my own way, in His way. I put it not my own, but in the Lord's way. And He says, anything that's humbugging me or troubling me, do not make it a problem. See, things could only becomes a problem when you worry about it. Things could only becomes a problem when you you feeding off their negative energy. But when you don't let nothing bother you. Things fade away. It just fades away. Oh, something happens to it. The universe is funny. That's why you got to be mindful what you put out there because it comes back to you. So when they antagonize me and I get upset and I start saying a lot of things that is not right, that goes in the universe. And remember, I have children too. So when I'm saying certain things in the universe, 
Remember, I have children to eco come come my children. That's why I say, be still and do not allow them to draw you out. Keep thy tongue still in thy mouth. Don't say nothing. Allow them to do what they do because that is what they do. And since they're working for the evil forces, they will get their pay. They will get their judgment. But if I follow them, if I follow them, if every, every time they know they are doing wrong and I open my mouth, it will look like I am making noise and I am provoking them when it's them who's making the noise. So he said, be still. Don't say anything. And my Lord will deal with them. And I guarantee you I know God exists. So I have a business about that. My Lord says, I will make your enemies to be your footstool. That's only if you hear my voice. That's only if you listen to me. That's only if you follow my commandments and my, my, my laws and statutes. God is telling us, if we just abide to him and only him, no matter what we're going through in our life, it could be handled and take care of. So that's what I'm doing. All praise.